Hi, we're here in Greensboro, North Carolina, finding out how students are using Google Apps. So let's hear what they have to say. I love Gmail because it does it in conversations. So if people reply to my email, it comes back with what I said, what they said, so you can keep track of what you're talking about. Because if not, you have to go and search for old emails. I really like the chat feature, so you don't have to wait so long on an email. You can actually sit there, ask your professor as many questions as you want, and you don't have to worry about getting an email six hours later. Yeah. I have my school calendar and my social life calendar. I'm able to organize my friends' calendars around mine, and that's the only way that I'm able to spend time with other people, is to find those white spaces. So I do for my assignments, my daily life schedule. I can also add on calendars like TV shows that if I don't want to look through the TV guide, I can just add them in there and they'll show me what times they're going to come on. Also, I can add the school events calendar so I can know what upcoming events are for my organization and everything. I use Google Docs and Google Apps for just about any group project that I do. Me and all my friends, we all get on there, we create one small little group, and then we're able to share every document we do on the project. If someone makes a change, we know about it, we can keep track of everything, anything that happens, and it's just great. I love it. We had to do this presentation, and there was a group of seven of us that had to do this. It's all seven of us at different times of the day. We got on there, added their report, Somebody, even at one point, completely rearranged all the slides and they said, oh no, I totally screwed up. It was no big deal. Went back to revisions that we needed to go. Everything's back the way it's supposed to be. No hassle, no mess. Come on. It was great to hear from lots of different students about how they're using Google Apps collaboratively inside and outside of the classroom. And we'd love to hear your story, so post it today.